Eric Jones Jr. acquired from Miami as a free agent. Hounding Curry on the relocate and Steph with the deep two. And so they get an improved defense to go with this brilliant offense. They're going to make noise in the West. Curry around Covington, past Nurkic, lay it up and in. He's on him. You switch Covington onto him. Look at the moves. Counter, back the other way, through the legs. Nurkic gets there too late. McCollum picked up his second foul, so Gary Trent Jr. has checked in. Warriors stay with the same five starters. And Steph Curry oh. hitting the wing jumper. Yes, Drop it in it. that three. Oh, Curry, little split. Smart. Step through and Steph with the layup. And so Steph Curry, beautiful beginning. And the turnover, point trip down. As they have the technical free throw and the three-point play. Curry right down the lane. How about that? That, that is how you expose Cantor. High, high pick and roll. Looking for Steph. Good screen by Bazemore. Three on the way. Perfect. Set the screen, move the ball, and get that kid the ball. And then Steph off a made three, reversing it up and in. Oh, Curry, what a first quarter. Getting downhill. You see Cantor there. He's like, great news. Cantor's on me. Let me get around him. Super easy. Crafty finishes. And his reaction to the foul that just happened. I'm on one. That's one of the better sequences of the year. Wiseman saved the turnover. Steph cut back door. Little floater. Ooh. Steph Curry's got 23. Teardrop me. Steph, he reloaded, went around <laughs> McCollum and made that three. Curry hiding behind Looney, weaving through traffic, down the lane, lefty finish. Steph is doing everything. There is a different energy to this man's game. Draymond three. Short. It's a pass it's to a pass. Steph. It's a pass. We'll call it the pass. Great the look. <laughs> the field goal and the foul. That's a good draw and kick. And Steph just had position. Derrick Jones Jr. was behind him and just stayed behind him. And look at the pass. Look, look I see you. Start of the season, one of 13. He's only 22% on the year. Curry for three. Oh. Lasers at home. Steph has the new building high of 40. They obviously have not played with big leads all year. Curry, little floater. He's got 42. <laughs> that teardrop is just so frustrating for Biggs. Seconds game shot clock to wind down this third. Steph, oh. step back three. Yes, Yo. sir. Oh. 45 for Curry. Uh, best way to get a clean look with double teams happening all that stuff. Sometimes it's 35 feet out. Ricochet to Steph. He just catches and launches a three. <laughs> like that. He's got 48. Gary Trent Jr. staying on top of Steph, working with Wiseman. Little leaner push shot. He's got 50. And this is just Steph taking his time. You see Gary Trent Jr. right behind him for the dance, the high knees, with a little shimmy after that New York one. He's got 54 to equal his career high, and the lead is 10. Tyrese Halliburton is out, Kalena, for tomorrow night. Yeah. As Curry has a new career high, double nickel. With all the focus on you, all the attention he's going to draw, everybody knows you're the main focal point for the defense. I mean, Lillard and McCollum went for 54, but Steph went for 56 by himself. <laughs> Curry from <Stop>. deep. 59! <laughs> Why not? Man, Steph just... Steph is running into the front court. Draymond <laughs> finds him. Another three. Oh Got it! 62! 62! And he actually surpasses his buddy, Clay Thompson. They're looking for him, too. Draymond Green, of course, his boy. Where's he at? Where's he at? Handoff. That is a tough shot, too. Gary Trent right at him. Steph, when you when you get 62, you have to do the halftime and the postgame interview. You don't, don't get out of it. that. I don't mind it. <laughs> we love talking to you. Hey, tell us about the 19 free throws. That's also a career best. Your mindset of attacking. We've seen you shoot threes your whole life, but really beautiful finishes and taking a lot of punishment tonight. Yeah, it's just kind of slowing down. Every game we're going to get better and more so just seeing the pictures of how they want to defend us and, and me individually and <laughs> get him get him <laughs> you see it yeah he was ready for it though he wasn't even he didn't jump or anything he's that's that's how on fire he is he can't even feel it uh, i don't even know what i was saying but just <laughs> shoot shots and 
make them, and then everything kind of opens up from there, just trying to get into the paint and make plays. Hey, Steph, are, are you almost looking forward to all the double teams and all the bodies you're going to see because of how you've mentally prepared and because of the way you can move without the ball after you give it up, you can get it back? Are you almost looking forward to seeing all those bodies? Not really, <laughs> but it's uh, as long as I can make the right decision and, yeah. um, you know, see the pictures, that's all it is. I mean, different shots from years past, and um, a lot of that is just not rushing. Even though there might be double teams and a crowd, I always have options to, you know, move it or get a shot or get to the basket. I just got to make sure I see everything right, and I think tonight we just slowed down a little bit, and it obviously worked out. All right, how aware are you of the point total that you had? I mean, you know, 54 was a career high coming in. When you get to that 40 spot and things like that, are, are you even aware of the numbers as they're piling up? Of course, uh, but you try to just continue to stay humble and stay in the moment. Um, that's the, the best way to approach it. It doesn't help when your teammates are yelling at you every dead ball, how many points you got. Um, <laughs> but other than that, it's just don't do anything differently. Just keep, uh, keep being aggressive, um, being decisive, and... You know, good things happen. And now when you had 59 and you were trailing Draymond for that last three, why do you got to do clay like that with his 60 and, and go for 62 there? Killer instinct. Yeah. I mean, it, it, it made so much sense that it was Draymond uh, knowing exactly what the situation was and knowing where I was at. Uh, for a hot second, I thought he wasn't going to look for me, but it, I shouldn't have never doubted it. He knew exactly where I was, and thankfully it went in. Did you talk about the way you attacked the rim? Obviously, Bob just talked about you getting to the free throw line, but you're finishing through contact or making sure you get the foul because you're jumping into the defender. You're not avoiding contact at all. Is that something you thought about a lot during the offseason? A little bit. Um, and, again, it's kind of just understanding what the, circum the situation is or how yep. they're defending. Um, and, and when you have you know, the, the right spacing and the right timing, your know, lanes open up, and then it's just all about finishing. I think you know, late in the first half, uh, there was a couple of plays where they sent a crowd, and I didn't read it right, so I tried to make those adjustments. Um, and like you said, it's just a matter of you know finishing with contact, being creative, or, or kicking it out. And you've been pumping iron, too, I see. <laughs> Got the arm. We, we had eight months. That's all I could do. <laughs> yeah, that's all you could do. And Steph, we'll let you go with this. You had a nice conversation with Damian Lillard at the end. His career best 61 came against the Dubs. Your career best 62 comes against the Blazers. Uh, sign me up for Lillard Curry all night long. I mean, you two are just wonderful to watch, and I know there's always kind of the game within the game, too. I mean, it's all, I, got, I said it before Friday's game. It's always, uh, you know, the, the best guys in the league, especially at the point guard position, bring the best out of you. And um, if you're around this league long enough, you kind of get to see every kind of scenario and situation. And, um, you know, we have a lot to fight for and a huge challenge in front of us there, you know, the established team now. So uh, for a guy like him, uh, like I said, it always just brings the best out of you. And I love the competition. Um, and that's kind of kind of what it is. Bro, you got a high audacity level. Is there any point in the season where at 18 seconds left on shot clock, you'll pull up from half court? Is that something that's maybe going to happen? We'll see. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Steph. Thanks for stopping, man. We appreciate it. Appreciate you. Congrats right, tonight. Brother. That is Wardell, Stephen Curry, a career.